What's good, YouTube? It's your homeboy at Camp Quarter Banks. Welcome to my channel, Cooling with Camp Quarter, where you will get content focused on streetwear, sneaker content, and of course, menswear fashion. Now, if this is your first time tuning into my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, notification bell, hit that like button, and drop a comment down below. All right, now today we got five stylish ideas that you all can wear for the summertime. So if you're trying to follow the color palette or you're trying to do the certain style between streetwear or casual style, it's up to you if you want to wear layers or you don't want to wear too many layers. I got those for you. So with that being said, let's just jump into these styles and show y'all how I did it for the summertime. All right, now first style is the Nike woven shorts. I already told you all this is popular for the summertime. It's good because it goes up. It doesn't wear too heavy on your shorts. And at the same time, it gives you a light breeze this is a light material and at the same time it goes above the knee which is very popular a popular trend for the summertime right now on top of me i have my oversized white t-shirt that comes from zara it's pretty thick but at the same time it can still be something cool because if i'm gonna wear it as one layer i won't get too hot now on top of me i have my gld chain which is a solid gold rope chain that i have i like this this is one of my favorite type of chains to wear in the summertime it's not too heavy not too light it's like just right now at the bottom i got some regular gray cruise socks those are chill for the summertime i like to have a little bit of color but if i don't want to go too loud or if i don't want to go too dark i'm gonna go with a gray color and that's gonna set it off just right now at the bottom is one of my favorite pair it's close to having some all white on whites which i've told you all about before these are the wolf gray air max ones these are my favorite joints because they look really classical so you could wear them either in a casual way or a streetwear way and as y'all can see i just did it with the streetwear style and just kept it real chill all right, now next style that I have, starting off at the top, you all can see I have my blue Canada hat. That's one of the most popular hats that's moving around right now. And then below that, I'll have my chain. Of course, I still have my rope chain. Now down below is a popular sweater that everybody was going for. I have a cream essential mock neck sweatshirt. Now I just got this for this season. I haven't really worn it too much because it's starting to get a little bit hot. But if you want to, you can wear this when it's in the like 50s, 60s, and you might be able to get away with it if it's around the low 70s or anything like that but anything higher than the 70s i wouldn't recommend but down below is my chino shorts that i got from uniqlo these are some of my favorite they have a casual look to it and at the same time you can fold these up and they'll still stay in place so as you walk they won't roll down or anything like that which is real fire now down below you will see that i have my black crew socks from dick sporting goods these joints are fire normally i will go with some nike joints but at the same time those are really thick, so I decided to go with DSG. And then down below, you'll see that I have some of my favorite Air Maxes. I have the Air Max 720s. These are in a blue coral colorway. These boys are fire. All right, next up is something fun for me because I just brought it with all type of color in here. You'll see the first thing first that I have is my green Oakland A's hat. It's a dark green. It starts off with this evergreen type of hat. And then down below, orange and green goes perfect hand in hand with each other. It has a hint of yellow up in here. You'll have some black on this shirt at the same time. So you have a mix of colors already. And at the same time, this is, I wouldn't say vintage and I wouldn't say retro, but it is an old complex kind of shirt that was from the Fat Tiger crew. They had this shirt, so it's very popular, so it won't be made ever again. So this is gonna be something that's like a staple piece. Now down below, you'll see I have my Nike woven shorts that's in the mint green or sage green. Have you wanna say which color it is? I say that it's sage green, but it's perfect for that green that I have up top. So it has a nice contrast, a nice blend with it, starting off with the evergreen up top with my hat, and then matching very well at the bottom with that sage green. Now, as you go lower, you will actually see that I have some black DSG socks, of course. I wanted to have a hard contrast on here. And at the bottom, I have my Nike Overreact ISPAs. These are like a hard contrast, but at the same time, it just brings a lot of attention to your feet. So that black socks that I have, and then straight to this bone color with a little bit of orange in there, a little bit of blue, the beige, a little bit of gray, and then it just looks like a really rugged shoe. It brings a lot of attention to my sneakers and to show that it is a complete streetwear outfit. And I just came here and I'm bringing the paint with all the color. All right, now next what I have, I went all blacked out until I get to the bottom and I'm all Nike'd out. So at the top, I have a very light Nike Air running shirt. These running shirts are very, very thin. So I mean like any type of movement from the wind, the shirt is moving right along with it. But it's perfect for if it's really hot, you sweating or anything like that, it's gonna be perfect. It has that material where it dries really quick. 
So this is perfect for the summertime, especially when you're going out to adventure areas like uh, amusement parks or zoos or wherever you're gonna be outside. If you're gonna be outside at a festival or picnic or whatever it be for a long time, it'll be perfect. Same thing I have down below is some running shorts as well. Now these are not the Nike woven shorts. These are just some regular running shorts and they are very, very thin. So what I will recommend if you do get these type of shorts, I wanna make sure that you have the same color shorts that you are wearing underneath. Make sure that your boxes or box of briefs or whatever you have is that same color because you'll be able to see right through. That's how thin they are. Now when you get to the bottom is when I bring my Chinatown Air Max Ones. These are some of my favorites because the color is just crazy crazy on here. So not only will you just see this entire black fit, it'll bring nothing but attention to my feet. So of course, that's the idea of this fit. Bring attention to my sneakers and at the same time, everything else up above is just gonna be chill. And lastly, what I have is a Vito Worldwide, another member of the Fat Tiger crew from Chicago. I have one of their retro tees. This is the Los Angeles tee. This has this old school rustic gray look to it, so it make it look aged and everything. And the color and a print on here, this yellow, this goldish yellow, make it look fire. Now, when we get down to the bottom, of course, you're gonna see that I have some more Nike shorts again. I kept those running shorts, so I wanted to show you how you could switch it up as well and still have this fashionable streetwear look. Now, when you get to the bottom, of course, I'm gonna have some black black socks to go along with it. But when you get down to the bottom and you'll see my sneakers, that's when the important part come in. I wanted to wear my purple Nike ACG Terra Nike Dunks. These are so fire simply because if you pay attention to that red dot, like I said, just like my sneakers, it doesn't have too much red. It has just a little hint of red. So on that swoosh, I wanted to match the red with each other. And at the same time, just go crazy with the rest of the colors because this is a dark outfit. So you'll see the black, you'll see the purple. And then something bright that pops out is them laces of course so that's what i wanted to do for this last style all right y'all now those are my five different styles that i have for the summertime hopefully y'all are able to take away from that let me know which out of the five that y'all like which style are y'all gonna go for color are y'all looking more for the streetwear approach casual approach from me wearing essential or did you like it with the nike or the crazy colors let me know drop those comments down below and by the way i'll have a link to everything that I have down from places that you could buy, stores that you could get things from. I'm finna get up out of here. I'm y'all homeboy, Cam Quarterbanks. Thank y'all for watching. Make sure y'all hit that like button. I'm out. I'm gone. I'll holla at y'all. Enjoy y'all summer, man. Peace.